Hi! If you are into gaming videos, you're going to like this tutorial. Today we'll show you how to make a free fire character glow effect with a twist. Any Fortnite fans watching this? Let's get right to it! First, as usual, let's switch to our favorite Prime workspace. Great! Now add your Fortnite screenshot to the resource window or directly to the scene. Duplicate it on the timeline and double-click the copy. Then launch the free shape drawing tool and outline the character, you know, more or less precisely. As soon as you finish, select the free shape you've just created and paint it black. From the menu, select Inverted Mask, go back to the main timeline tab and disable the visibility of the original image. Now duplicate the free shape layer, place the copy above and open its properties window. In the properties window, set the following parameters. Pen, color, white. Pen, thickness, 15. Go back to the Blending Mode menu again and select Blend. Brush, Fill Background, Transparent. Alright, it's time to glow things up. In the Template window type Shadow and drag the shadow effect to the timeline. In the Properties window set the following parameters. Light Angle, 0. Shadow Distance, 0. Shadow Color, Cyan. Shadow max size 70. Now let's add some distortion. Apply the distort effect and set the following parameters. Type, wave, frequency, 300. Amplitude, 0 0.5. Phase, 0. Angle, 0. Finally, click the frequency parameter. Open the template menu and select Sinuside. You can type your own values here, but just for the sake of this tutorial, here's what we used. Minimum curve value 280, maximum curve value 320, frequency 50. Click the free shape duplicate again, the one with the white outline, and apply black fill. Go back to the main timeline tab, open the blending menu, and select screen. Now look at this glow. The effect is ready, but yes, as you may have noticed, it's static. In the next video, we'll show you how to apply the glow effect to a moving character. If that sounds like your cup of tea, make sure to subscribe and let us know what you think in the comments below.